We live in a time when African Americans and LGBTQ people face increasing violence. That's just a fact. According to the FBI, hate crime reports motivated by sexual orientation rose 5% in 2017. Reports of hate crimes against black people in that same year rose 16%. What is harmful about Jesse Smollett's alleged hoax is that it clouds those very dangerous facts, those truths. Why would anyone, especially an African-American man, use the symbolism of a noose to make false accusations? How could someone look at the hatred and suffering associated with that symbol and see an opportunity to manipulate that symbol to further his own public profile? Only Smollett knows the answers as to why, if he in fact made this whole thing up. At this point, Jussie's lawyers maintain he is innocent. But the truth is, damage has already been done because many just don't believe Jussie is innocent anymore. And that disbelief could spill over and sow doubt on legitimate hate crimes committed too often in this country on the basis of race and or homophobia. Crimes like the 52 hate-related homicides against people who identify as LGBTQ in 2017, the most recorded in a single year, as reported by the National Coalition of Anti-Violence Programs. Of those 52 deaths, 60% of the victims were black. It is because of these truths that Smollett's possible untruth is so dangerous. His alleged attack cheapens those that do happen. And then there comes the issue of place. Chicago. That city knows racism and bigotry all too well. On its streets and in its police department. Some of it earned, but this, the head of the police department says, is not. So I'm offended by what's happened and I'm also angry. I love the city of Chicago and the Chicago Police Department, warts and all. But this publicity stunt was a scar that Chicago didn't earn and certainly didn't deserve. In all, if Jussie's story is just that, a story, it very possibly put more lives at risk. Black LGBTQ lives that were already less safe even before this because the FBI statistics prove it. Today, the executive producers of Empire, the show Jesse stars in, said that his character has been written out of the final episodes of the current season.